interesting lesson. Most of the things you know, you will be surprised. Now we go to the key. Yes, lesson 27. What is the main theme of lesson 27? Pronouns. We all know pronouns. We are very fluent right? in, in depicting pronouns and analyzing pronouns. But now we go in more detail. Kinds of pronouns. <laughs> In this lesson, we learn the following. What is the first thing we learn? Kinds of pronoun. How many kinds of pronoun? There are two kinds of pronouns. Pronouns are either separate. What is the meaning of that? Pronouns are either separate. Munfasilun. Or they are attached. There are two kinds. Eh? They are munfasilun or muttasilun. Muttasil is attached. You know it, we have done many times. Muttasilun, munfasilun. If you say huwa talibun, so that huwa is munfasilun. Munfasilun. Separate. The separate pronouns are independent. The separate pronouns are independent and not attached to any other word. Yes, not attached to any word. They usually occur at the start of a sentence. They also occur after illa. Start of the sentence, illa. Anna, I want to define it. You have to remember, I don't think it's mentioned here. Pronouns, they are mabni. They can be mutasilun or munfasilun. They are mabni. But they are definite. They are definite. We have to remember, they are definite. So, I will define this. Anna, how will I define it? Damirun, Munfasilun, Babniun Allah Sukun, Fi Mahali Rafain. Now we have to define it. Fi Mahali Rafain, Mubtada. One more time, I'll say. Anna, Damirun, Munfasilun, Sukun, define it properly. Fimahali Rafa'in Mubtida. Muslimun Khabarun Marfun Bidamma. Muslimun Khabarun Marfun Bidamma. I am a Muslim. Ma Fahima Darsa Illa Anta. No one understood the lesson except you. Again, Munfasilun, Munfasilun, huh? separate. Huh? Okay. This, it is you I saw. It is you that I saw. Iyaka raituhu. No, Iyaka is again Munfasilun, Munfasilun. Huh? It is you I saw. Huh? Fine. Or you can say, Ma raitu. I did not see except Iyaka. I did not see none but you. We are going to learn this. You are going to love it. Alhamdulillah. The attached pronouns are not independent. Yeah. The attached pronouns are not independent, but are always attached to other words. Yes. Damirun Mutasilun is always attached to something else, you know. Here. Raitu ka, tu and ka, both are, you know, pronouns which are attached. One is marfu, comes as a file, 
and then this is nafurun bihi, tu and ka. Here, tu is attached pronoun meaning I, and ka is attached pronoun meaning you. We know that nouns indicate their function in the sentence sentence by changing by changing their ending by changing their ending you know we know that nouns yes nouns nouns indicate their functions in the sentence by changing their ending no <laughs> I want to tell you something. It was in 2006. I was given the opportunity to start a Madina book course, intense, intense Madina book course. Before that, I used to take once a week class in almost all the massages of Toronto. Alhamdulillah, I have taught. But then there was a request that two years is too long a time. Let us finish it as quickly as possible. So I took that challenge and we started in Talimul Uttam Masjid, Monday to Thursday, four days a week, from, from nine o'clock to Zohar prayers. Four days a week. It was not easy. Not easy on me, not easy on the students. It was a very gruesome and hard task. But I took it and I prayed. And that is where the beginning of my grammar songs took place at that time in. Uh, Talim al Islam in 2006, when I did the video. Now, the point is this I wanted to make it easy. I want to making a lear learning, making a fun, joy. So I introduced the songs. I, I don't know how Allah inspired me. I'm not a musician, but I do love music but i'm not a musician and so i'm not a composer but alhamdulillah allah inspired me and this is where those songs started coming so we had a almost four hour class and then we would take a break after one hour and 30 minutes or so break for what Tea break? No, no. We never took tea break. We took tea and samosa break. <laughs> we always had tea and samosa. So I used to say tea and samosa break. In between the time we started the class and the Zohar time. So now my brothers and sisters, these things were composed at that time. So now, because we are talking about pronouns and all the uh, nouns that indicate their function in the sentence by changing their ending. What are those ending? The khalal waladu marfu, saltu walada marsu, kultuli waladi majrur, marfu. Mansu, Majrur. So I started this song. When I say dun, it's marfu. You can sing with me. When I say dun, it's mansu. When I say din, it's majru. One more time. When I say dun, it's marfu. When I say dun, it's mansu. When I say din, it's majru. So, 
This was the first grammar song of my life. Huh? Okay. But pronouns do not change their ending. But the pronoun, this is the noun. They change their endings. The nouns change their ending to indicate their functions in the sentence. Are they file? Are they mafulun bihi? Are they some majroor? But pronouns do not change their endings. They change themselves entirely. Yes. We know it, but now we are studying in detail. But pronouns do not change their ending. They are fixed. Mabani. They change themselves entirely. For example, Asaluka. Mananta. Mananta, see? Mananta. Asaluka. Different ending. They are both ka. Anta. So anta is marfu. Yarfa is a marfu. But we have to define it. Damirun, Munfasilun, Mabnin Ala Fato, Mabnin Ala Fata, Fi Mahali Rafin, Mubtida, Marfu. And Ka is Mansu. Damirun, Muttasilun, Munfasilun, Muttasilun, Mabnin Ala Fata, Fi Mahali Nasbin, Mafulun Bi. So there are two sets of pronouns. One for Rafa, for Marfu, the other for Nasab and Jar, the other for Mansub and Majru. And each of these two X has two forms. Each of them has two forms now. Now we are learning in detail. One separate and the other attached, yes. Each of them have two forms. So there are two sets of pronouns, one for Rafa, man, Marfu, and the other for Nasab and Jar, Mansub and Majru. And each of these two sets has two forms, one separate and the other attached. Now, this is very interesting, inshallah. The pronouns of Rafa, huh? the separate forms, huh? They got their own form. Huh? Pronouns of Rafa. Huh? Do you know this now, my brother and sister? Do you know this? This was my second grammar song. See, third person, huwa huma hum, hiya huma hunna. Second person, anta antuma antum, anti antuma antun. And the first person, I, ana nahinu. Did you get the idea? This was my second song. Why I felt Allah inspired me? Because these songs make make easy for us to, to remember. And I used to joke uh, and say, the sisters, when they are cooking and they are turning the food around, they can turn around and sing. <laughs> While they are turning the food. <laughs> or when you are driving on a highway, before you get bored, sing. <laughs> and it will then remember, we will remember, we will never forget inshallah. The attached forms, the following are the attached forms of Rafa. 
attach forms of the rafa. What are they? Zahab tu, they are attached, but they are marfu. Zahab tu, zahab tuma, zahab tum, zahab ti, zahab tunna. And then, alif of dual. Zahaba, zahabata, and then mudaria, yazabani, tazabani, then amar, izhaba. They are all have alif, Muthanna is their file. And here, ta is, is marfu. It's marfu. It's the file. Mutaharik ta. They have ta. There has got a proper vowel sign. Alif of dual. And vowel of plural. Zahabu, yazabuna, tazabuna, izhabu amar. All of them have Wow is a plural. And then Ja of second person feminine. Tazabina. So see, Tazabina, if I define it, Fianun, Mudarion, Marfun, Bisubuti Noon. Where is the file? Al Yaw. Al Yaw is the file. Huh? Yaw. Bina, it is, it is got a sukun here. Yeah. Tazabina. Is habi, is habi. You go. Huh? So this is fail amar, and this is the file. Is habi. You go. This is the file. Huh? Is habi. Yeah. The noon of the feminine plural. Yes. Yes habna nunu niswa. Yes habna mudaria. Tazhabna, Izhabna, Amar. Huh? These are the Nuna feminine plural. Nunu Niswa. Nunu Niswa. The Na of the first person plural. Yeah. The Na of first person plural. Zahabna. Huh? This is our plural. Huh? Zahabna. Huh? It's a file coming. Huh? The attached pronouns of Rafa are hidden in the following forms. They are hidden. Very much in detail, you will read it, inshallah. Read it slowly, my brother. You will enjoy. And remember, all these things will result, will result for you more hasanat. More hasanat. And hasanat are very important. Manja bil hasanati. Oh, Allah has given us guarantee that you do one good deed, Allah will give you ten times the reward. Man jaa bil hasanati, fallahu ashru amsada. He got ten times the reward of just doing once, you know. The attached pronouns are, are hidden in the following case. Here also they are attached, but they are hidden. Zahabat. And Zahaba. Note that the ta in Zahabat is not a pronoun. It is a particle denoting feminine gender. And then the mudaria. The mudaria, you know, these are attached pronouns. So where are the attached pronouns in mudaria? Yazabu, tazabu, azabu. Nazabu. Mustatir. Mustatir. Right? So they are the mudaria, they are the form, forms of Rafa. Right? I have always told you jokingly, five in your pocket. Hua, here, anta, ana, nahnu. Hua yadhabu, hiya tazabu, anta tazabu, ana azabu, nahnu nazabu. All the files, four forms, they are all attached pronoun of rafa or hidden. They are hidden in all these things. Now we come here, something very interesting. Very interesting. You will love it, inshallah. 
See, so much to learn. So much to learn, alhamdulillah. And we will learn it. We will learn it. Separate forms. Huh? That was Muttasilun. Now it is Munfasilun. You have not been introduced to these forms before. Yes. We have not been introduced. These forms are composed of the word ia plus that is pronoun of nasab, which you have already known. Ia ka. This is mansub. Remember this thing. This is a sign of being mansub. You have not been introduced to these forms before. These forms are composed of the word ia plus the attached pronoun, attached pronoun of nasab, which is ka, like that, you know. You already know ia ka. See, we say in the Surah Al Fatiha, how many times we say Surah Al Fatiha? In our prayers, five times prayer, plus people pray Sunnah and Nafal. So you say, Iyaka na abudu. Iyaka na abudu. Wa Iyaka na stain. Iyaka, thee alone we worship. And thee alone we seek help. So that thing, Iya is a mafulun bihi. Mafulun bihi. Huh? Third person. Iyahu. Yahuma, Yahum, Yaha, Yahuma, Yahunna. Second person, Yaka, Yakuma, Yakum, Yaki, Yakuma, Yakunna. Ya, 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 na. Did you get the idea? Again, I had composed the songs. Yahu, Yahuma. Yahum, Yaha, Yahuma, Yahuna, Yaka, Yakuma, Yakum, Yaki, Yakuma, Yakuna, and then Yaya, Yana. Did you get the idea? Remember this. If you try to remember the song, you will enjoy more, inshallah. Yahu, Yahuma, Yahum, Yaha, Yahuma, Yahuna, Yaka, Yakuma, Yakum, Yaki, Yakuma, Yakuna, and then. Ya 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 na. Did you get the idea? Now, here is something else. The attached forms. Now, again, attached forms we are learning. These are also attached forms of nasab, mansub. All they are always mansub. It will come. More is coming. Huh? Then. These forms cannot be mentioned independently. They should be attached to the verb. Yes, or to Inna or one of the sisters. They are to be attached. They are, the forms cannot be mentioned independently. They should be attached to the verb like so now they are, they are mansub. Huh? They are mansub, nasab. Huh? They are mansub. Huh? So these are the different forms of mansub. We can say it's still same thing. Salahu, salahuma, salahum. Salaha, salahuma, salahuna. Salaka salakuma salakum salaki salakuma 
salakunna salani salana no what are they sala is a verb he asked whom did he ask he asked him he asked two of them he asked them he asked her he asked two of them he asked all of the sisters he asked you two of you all of you salakum he asked you the monas salakuma salakuna all the ladies salani he asked me salana he asked us so now you have to remember another important thing the attached form of pronoun of the first first person singular is ya only eh? first person singular is ya only this is plural and ya only singular the noon is noon vikaya the noon of protection eh? salani so how can we define sala fenu madin mabnun ala fata the noon vikaya noon of protection and then ya mutakallam bi sukun this is the mafulun bihi salana straight away he asked us like that inshallah now the pronoun of jar the pronoun of jar okay again allah bless me to make more song they are there i used to sing all the time so when we say you know vena pronoun joins a noun ha huh? pronoun joins a noun we get muda muda filehi when a pronoun joins preposition we get jarun wa majrun when a pronoun joins zarf zarf alone we say zarf wa muda filehi did you get the idea you must have heard in the tape also when a pronoun joins a noun yes when you pronoun joins a noun we get mudaf mudaf ilayhi huh? kitabuhu rabbuhu huh? mudaf mudaf ilayhi when a pronoun joins preposition we get jarun wa majrurun when a pronoun joins zarf we get zarf and mudaf ilayhi Did you get the idea, Inshallah? See, min hu, min huma, min hum. See, min hu. What is this? Jar majrur. Min huma, jar majrur. Min ha, min huma, min huna. The pronoun of jar have only the attached form. That's all. They are same as pronoun of nasab. Who, whom, whom, ha, whom, whom, ka, whom, whom, ki, whom, whom, na, ya, na. So these are the can be used for nasab. If you attach them to a verb, it will be a nasab. If you attach them to a preposition, it will be jar majru. Did you get the idea? Inshallah. when to use separate pronouns of nasab yeah this is the most important thing this was just introduction for us to remember i hope you will remember inshallah if i can finish this no no this we are finishing we'll start something else when to use the separate pronoun of nasab which is uh, see now 
You can say Nabuduka. Can you define Nabuduka? Nabudu, Felion Mudarion, Marfun Bid Dhamma, Fail Mustatir, Takdirihu Nahn, we worship. Ka, what is Ka? See, with the verb, Ka becomes you. That is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we worship you. <clears throat> but I want to bring Ka in front. Uh, I want to bring Ka in the front. Nabu Du. Ka is there at I bring it in front. Is it possible? No, it is not possible. Because this is always attached. This is the attached pronoun, so it remain attached. It will remain attached. It will remain attached. It cannot be separated. So how do I separate it? How do I separate it? So this is ka is cancelled. Nabudu ka. So I want to bring it in front. No, it cannot because this is always a attached pronoun. It cannot come. So then I have to take a support of what is my support? What is my support? Here. Yeah. Huh? This pronoun is attached pronoun, cannot come alone by itself. So then it needs the support of Ia. Yeah. So Ia yeah, ka. So that is what is happening. And there is an emphasis. Huh? See, we say Nabaduka, fine, that is good. But then we say, Iyaka Nabadu, it is you, it is you only, Nabaduka, we worship you. But Iyaka, we bring, brought it in front of the verb. We brought it in front of the verb and we gave the the verb which was attached the, now we give the verb of support yeah so by doing that we can bring it in the front without yeah the the ka cannot stand so yeah ka nabadu it is you that we worship so also it has got some translators say it is thee or it is you. Uh, it is thee. We only worship. Emphasis. Uh, it is you. We only worship. Uh, there is a force in it, power in it, you know. We cannot say Nabudu ka, Nabudu as ka is an attached pronoun. It cannot stand alone. Yes. It cannot stand alone, it is attached pronoun. So then we give the support of yeah. Okay. Now these are the conditions. Huh? The pronoun of nasab should be separate in the following cases. When you bring it in the front and give the support of yeah, the next term is same thing. If it is a mafurun be of a master. It is the mafurun bihi of a master. Nantaziru ziyarat al mudiri iyana. Again, the iyana comes. <clears throat> of a master. Mafurun bihi of not a verb, but a master. We are awaiting the headmaster's visit to us. Visit, visit. Nantaziru 
ziyaratul mudiri now ziyarata is the mafulun bi far nantaziru intazara yantaziru then huwa mudaf and mudaf ilayhi and then we say iyana that is the mafulun bi for master did you get the idea here also we have to use iyana nantaziru we are waiting ziyarata mafulun bi mudaf mudaf ilayhi iyana so this is mudaf ilayhi of a master here iyana is the object of the master ziyarata here is another example musada musadatu ka musadatu ka iyaya this is master kanat kabla musadati iyaka your help to me was before my help to you musadatu ka iyaya kanat kabla before musadati your help iyaka to you iyaya to you to me before to you now it may confuse you but i don't want to be you to be confused saada to help form 3 saada you saidu and said it will be amar and then what is the mastara form 3 there are two kinds of masters but i will only go to this one musaadatu mufaalatu mufaalatu musaadatu this is the master ha huh? saada yusaidu musaadatu so this is the master so this is mafurun bihi for the master huh? again same mafurun bihi for the master number 3 if it occurs after a conjunction yes rules 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 beautiful rules and if you understand that's good enough my brother then you can revise we will have so much revision when we do the main lesson a lot of revision when we do the main lesson inshallah now it can come after conjunction raituka wa iyahu i saw you and him we cannot say raituka hu raituka hu no we will say raituka wa iyahu wa iyahu then we have to use separate independent i saw you with him raituka i saw you with him with him huh? this is with him huh? here we cannot say raituka wahu we cannot say raituka wahu huh? we we cannot even say raituka hu forget about that we cannot say raituka wahu no we cannot say raituka wa iyahu so raitu ka wan mafulun bi then harf atfin and another mafulun bi and it is mawtufun ala this baw zarf ja harf atfin wa iyahu so we there are more explanation we cannot say raitu ka wa hu who is an attached pronoun and cannot stand alone so we have to give the support of ya in the same way we say inni wa iyaka wa war fu atfin indeed i and you have passed inni wa iyaka najihani verily i and you have passed did you get the idea inshallah we cannot say inni wa ka 
inni vaka nor we can say inni va anta no because uh, anta is the pronoun of rafa we need mansu inni va anta no we cannot say this also inni vaka of course this can be a pronoun of nasab but no it's it cannot come alone it has to be joined so we say inni va iyaka na jihani remember these are beautiful rules you will enjoy it inshallah number 4 if it occurs after illa after illa la nabudu illa iyahu we worship none but him allah la nabudu illa we cannot say illa hu no illa iyahu ma saltu illa iyaka i ask none but you that is after illa remember and then number 5 if it occurs after an address program of nasab if it occurs after an attach pronoun of nasab it comes after a pronoun which is attach so then we have to see see here look at it ataitu huh? i gave it i gave it you ataitu hu ha ataitu hu iyaha iyaha another give something ataitu hu iyaha here is the sentence aina majallatul mudiri yes now it makes clear huh? majallata is a monas so, so what is the aina majallatul mudiri aina majallatul mudiri majallatul mudiri where is the magazine of the teacher so we say ataitu hu i gave it to him to him iaha the magazine iaha monas ataitu hu iaha we cannot say ataitu hu ha ataitu hu ha no ataitu hu iaha where is the headmaster's magazine i gave it to him yes i gave it to him i gave it to him i gave it yeah i gave to him i gave it to him where is the headmaster's magazine i gave it to him ataitu hu yeah who is one of ulun bi yeah goes to the magazine fine here we cannot say ataitu ataitu hu wa <laughs> ataitu hu ataitu hu ha we cannot say that ataitu hu ha na hu ha hu ha no no ataitu hu ha means ataitu hu ya ha ataitu hu ya ha if both the pronouns belong to the same person as in this example the second pronoun should be separate yes if it belongs to the same person it should be separate if they belong to different persons we can use either the attached or separate pronoun though it is better to use the attached pronoun attached pronoun fine aina kitabi aina kitabi where is my book ataitu ka iyahu ataitu ka iyahu i gave it to you i gave that magazines to you iyahu is i gave it gave it i gave it you it i gave it to you you is here and it is here or you can say 
ataitu kahu, ataitu kahu. But it is better to use attached pronoun, huh? attached pronoun. So it is better to use the attached pronoun. Well, you can do both are applicable, uh, fine. Now, one of the patterns of the master is failu. Ranna uh, jarasu, the bell rang. Ranna, to ring. What is ranin? Ringing. Ringing. These are both possible, my brother. Atai tuka yahu or atai atai tu kahu. Though it is better to use attached pronoun. Maybe maybe this is better to use. This is separate pronoun. This is this is better. In that case, you can say like that. Atai tu kahu atai tu kahu anyway then safara he whistled safirun whistling alhamdulillah so we finished the ori uh, uh, we finished the key uh, we finished the key now we go to the main lesson we are almost about time to finish. Let us see how much we can. Yeah, this is the lesson. Adarsu Sabiu Wal Ishruna. So now Brothers and sisters, I will again start from here. We won't be able to do much, but we have time. I can just read something. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the lesson. It's a it's a beautiful lesson. But again, a lot of rules to remember. Inshallah, they are not difficult rules. You will understand the pronouns very well after this lesson. Al Mudarisu Ya Uthama Al Murakibu Yatlubuka Fi Maktabihi. The Murakib Yatluba Yatlubuka is demanding you, calling for you. Fi Maktabi in his office, in his office. Yatlubu ka, talaba yatlubu, to ask, ka, he's asking you, he's asking you, demanding you, Fi Maktabi in his office. Usama, Uridu an ahuza mai. I wish to take with me, take with me, Zamilaya, Hazaini, two more, Zamilaya, Zamilani, Zamilaini, Zamilaini, and you put ya, Zamilaya, 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 Hazaini. Lam yatlub, he did not. Lam yatlub, murakibu, illa yak. <laughs> illa came, then we have to say, here we don't say lam yatlub ka, murakibu, no. This is more eloquent, eloquent. Lam yatlub, yatlubil, murakibu, majizum, because of lam. File illa iyaka. Aksha, I'm afraid. Anahu nasiya, he forgot. Inni, <laughs> beautiful sentence. You should read it. Something nice to read. Enjoy reading it. A super dialogue, super dialogue.
from a person of immense knowledge, Dr. Abdurrahim. Aksha Anahu Nasiya. I'm afraid he forgot. Inni wa iya huma. Verily, myself wa iya huma. And this is after wow. Iya huma. Mushtarikuna. Participating. Participants. Fi musabakati sivahati. Swimming competition. Musabakati. Form three. Sabaka yusabiku master musabakatum sivahati swimming. Mushtarikuna ishtaraka yashtariku isam file mushtarikuna participants. Inni wa iya huma. But that beautiful, beautiful. Iya huma mushtarikuna fi musabakati sivahati. Khudhuma is an, in that case, take them. Aina kitabul mudiri ya Ibrahim. See the beautiful sentence. What is the sentence? Ataitu hu iyahu. Ataitu hu iyahu. Ataitu. Ata yuti tu mafulun bi ataituhu iyahu. We cannot say ataituhu hu, ataituhu hu. No, they are same hu hu, but we cannot say we have to separate them. Ataituhu iyahu. Wa aina dafatiru tulabi ataituhum iyaha. I gave them Yaha goes to the Dafatira. Mornas. Yaha. Did you get the idea? Inshallah. Vahin al Majalati. And where is my magazine? Ataitu Kaha. Together. Now see now here they are separate. You can say Ataitu. Ka yaha, or you can say ataitu kaha. Explanation comes for using this very beautiful mata ataita niha ataita niya all together. Ataitu ka ha ataitu ka ha amsi fi maktabika. Afakstaha, you took it, wadataha, and you put it. Durji in your in your draw. Durji is draw. Nam, nam, nam. Alana Tazakkartu. I remember now. Masmuka Yahi. The brother says, Aiyaya Tas Alu, Yaustad. Aiyaya. Are you asking me, Tas Alu, Yaustad? Nam iyaka asalu. <laughs> nam iyaka niya nam asaluka. But here, nam iyaka asalu. We'll do the rest of it, inshallah. Nam. Did you say something? Nam Yakasan. Hua. The he person replies, Ismi Ukasha. Il Tahaktu Bil Mahadi Al Yauma. I joined the university today. Wal Tahaka. Wal Tahaka. Mai Salasatu Tulabi. And three more students with me joined. Min Baladi. Three more students from my country joined. Hum fi faslin akhara. Ya Ustad, arju an tusahadani fakad fatatini durusun kasiratun. Did you get the idea? Alhamdulillah. Now, uh, they are very beautiful. 
but we'll start inshallah we'll start i'll go again here and i write down some notes we'll do it inshallah i hope you enjoyed it's a very interesting lesson i hope you enjoyed eh? uh, brothers my computer problem is still not resolved partially resolved but i cannot use it after a couple of days again i get different windows open and they i cannot function so i am working with the brother who is helping me but the arif ali once it is done then i'll be sending you everything together right now if the brother yusuf jamal right now my computer is dead huh? right now it's not working i started in the morning it was dead so i have called brother arif ali is working on it and uh, so when brother yusuf jamal uh, uploads it today's lecture on youtube please go to youtube huh? please go to youtube and you will say uh, madina book lesson 26 session 3 or as sometimes brother yusuf jamal says madina book lesson 26 c instead of session he said c remember that huh? so this will be available tonight so please follow it alhamdulillah we pray now my brothers and sisters may allah subhanahu wa taala accept your sacrifice of time to study and understand the quran and arabic language as a hasanat in your scale of good deeds yes amin ya rabbal alamin may allah subhanahu wa taala bless you all your spouses and your children with the excellent health barakats in your risk in your jobs in your businesses in your careers in your profession in your education and in the education of your children amin ya rabbal alamin May Allah subhanahu wa taala bless us all with a strong memory and deep knowledge of Arabic to understand in depth the message of the Quran, so that we all feel the miracle of the Quran in our hearts. Amin ya rabbal alamin. May Allah subhanahu wa taala enlighten our homes, our families with the light. of the quran and may allah subhanahu wa taala instill this light in our children so important i pray in our children and may allah subhanahu wa taala instill the light of the quran in our children may allah subhanahu wa taala keep us all safe and protected from the evil of this virus may allah subhanahu wa taala protect the muslim umma all around the world wherever they may be residing from the evil of this virus may allah subhanahu wa taala protect the humanity at large from the evil of this virus see you next saturday inshallah keep safe stay healthy wear mask when you go out and observe physical distancing and follow the guidelines of the health authority rabbana atina fi dunya hasanatan wa fil akhirati hasanatan wa qina azab annar rabbana hab lana min azwajina wa zurriyatina qurrata ayun wa ja'alna lil muttaqina imama rabbana taqabbal minna innaka antas samiul alim wa tub alayna innaka antat tawwabur rahim سبحان ربك رب العزه عما يصفون 
وسلامو على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين Take care, my brothers and sisters. See you next Saturday, inshallah. Stay safe. Stay healthy, inshallah. Jazakumullahu khairan. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.